all right hi you guys welcome back to my channel so today i am going to be making a wrap for my door and i would like to make it in um oh, what do you call it uh a thanksgiving theme i actually got these really cute things at hobby lobby um it comes with a little pumpkin you know a little pine cone then i also got this one you know different different styles and i also got this one which i really like you know, it looks really nice also i did end up getting some of these little nuts <laughs> i think they look cute and then i also got this sign that says family I couldn't find any that said happy Thanksgiving or give thanks or anything, but I thought this one would look really nice. And then I also got these really nice pearls with little yellow flowers. I think they look really cute. And then I also got these pairs of beads. You know, they're I like the color. And I got burlap. So let's get started. Alright, so the first thing I did was take out all the little tags or anything, you know, like these little elastics. I couldn't take this off, but, you know, I don't think it matters since I will be sticking it in or gluing it into the wreath. So, now, what you want to do with your leaves is grab a, a pliers um, and I um, mean pliers the wires and actually cut these out so that you can have everything separated and since these come with a bunch um, you can take off the um, what's it called uh, the flower tape and uh, separate everything so that you can work uh, with them better all right so now that I have everything separated, I make sure that, you know, leave them with the wires that they come on for the fact that since we don't know how we're going to place them on yet, you don't want to cut them like very low and then, you know, you don't want to stick them somewhere else. And then here are all my leaves and all of these little small cranberry looking figures and these. I think that I'm going to wait off on cutting these or separating these because I don't know where I'm going to be placing them yet. Um, same thing goes for, for the beads. Um, I think I might be probably cutting them and placing them as long as they go or just um, maybe keep it, you know, the way it is so that I can put it on my wreath. Uh, so this is a wreath that I will be using. Um, now it just comes to your imagination. So now you can start by placing, you know, here, placing them here or cutting it or, you know, placing it somewhere else. Um, You know, now basically you're just going to fix them any way that you would like to. Um, be sure to add lots of leaves. Um, if you want to cover your whole entire wreath, you can cover it all. If you just want to do one side of it, you can do one side of it. Um, now it's just all about your imagination and seeing how you would like to put it on. You know, if you want this one here or sticking out or anything, you know, you can stick them in the branches and, you know, let's see. like start making things come to life, if, <laughs> if I explain myself, um, you know, and then you guys can add a little pine cone. You know, maybe the pretty side, not the ugly side. You know, just start fixing it in the way that you will like it. And I will be back and I will show you my ending. So this is 
so far what I have done it's going there you know still got a lot more to go so here's what I've got so far it's looking really nice you guys I still got more of these and I've still got a couple of leaves left to glue on and I still have to do the burlap bow which I am going to stick um, my sign right here in the middle which is actually gonna go hanging on like this so that's how it's going there's really you guys you can't mess this up you know you can just arrange your little pumpkins, um, little cranberries, your leaves, anywhere where you guys like. Um, you know, fall is all about just a whole bunch of reds, orange, yellows, and you really just have to get inspired to it. But I will bring you up with the final up on my door so that I can show you how it looks like at the end all right you guys so this is a final look it's already hung up on my door that's my burlap bow my little sign I added these orange strings because I thought it was it gave a little pop of look and there you go so here's here is my final thing so so it looks on my door so hope you guys like this tutorial and if you guys decide to make this DIY riff um, please share pictures or comment below thank you